And the festival is not only about the music, it's also about the art, the attractions, and of course the food. News Channel 3's Bianca Ventura spoke with a festival vendor and some festival goers about their experience. When you step foot on the Coachella Festival grounds, you see stages, art installations, and of course, food and beverage stands like this one. Stephen Vading, administrative manager for Just Squeeze Juice, tells me he has been hiring people to help run their lemonade stands since January. Vading wasn't able to disclose just how much money a festival food stand worker can walk away with after receiving their hourly wages and tips. It's probably enough to make it worth their trip, the taking off a month's worth of, of whatever work they have had. So uh, at the end of the day, everyone goes home really happy. I asked Vading what he thought about this year's food prices, which seemed to be a topic of discussion among festival goers. Unfortunately, you know, our costs have gone up, gas prices go up, inflation, a lot of the supply chains backed up. So even, you know, some of our equipment becomes more expensive. So it really does goes into our final price point. Some festival goers said food prices definitely caught their attention this weekend. Because you see it everywhere. They post like, oh my God, ice creams are like $6. Like, what is this? But you just, you deal with it. Like, you, it's the price you pay for going to a festival. You know, you kind of just have to. But they say they expect the high prices, and it's part of the festival experience. And it's like when you're hungry and like you've been there for so long, you're kind of just like, you know what, I just have to, so I'll just pay the price. Overall, we've had really good response. Uh, our tips are great. People are really nice here. That's why we love Coachella people, and it's just a good time. In Indio, Bianca Ventura, News Channel 3. And we have more music festival coverage online at KESQ.com, including festival flaws. Find out about the locals that aren't really singing praises about the festival, how they are complaining about traffic, and even the noise. Plus, learn about Coachella NFTs, and we will also have information on road closures around the festival. It's all on our website, KESQ.com.